Hey guys, welcome to the channel. I'm not gonna lie, I nearly had a nervous breakdown working on this piece. In a realistic world, I would have pre-cut out all these stencils and possibly used a screen print with some acrylic and a squeegee. However, in my case, I don't have a screen printing facility and I don't have a squeegee and I only have a few acrylics so I decided to take on the mind-boggling task of building up all these layers just using some masking tape and a cutting knife Prior to starting this piece, I had a basic theme in my head. I wanted to incorporate elements of one of my favourite movies of all time, being Blade Runner. And also to add elements of love and fantasy, with a little bit of a dystopian, futuristic vibe to the overall piece. I don't have any specific set of rules or structure in place. I'm just going with the flow and enjoying the whole creative process. It really is a joy to create with no set of rules in place. I personally feel that it is at this moment when time just stops. So after I cut out and apply each layer, I take a step back and as the piece progresses, new ideas start to develop. I just keep applying and applying them until the piece eventually starts to come together. Initially I wanted the origami horse that is featured on the Blade Runner movie poster to be a symbolic element in the piece. Not only is it a reoccurring theme in the movie, as the character K is reminded that he is a replicant, but it also is the driving quest in which K's character searches for his humanity. By applying the horse, it also added somewhat of a structure to the piece, and as a result, it influenced me to apply these sharp gestures and angles, creating new shapes and forms, in which I was also able to incorporate some graphics into these shapes. this stage in the piece, I'm starting to have a lot of fun as I'm kind of overall very happy with the whole layout. So now I want to start incorporating elements to really tie it all together and give it a, a more artistic kind of look to the piece. So in the Blade Runner movie, there is some lettering featured throughout the movie and I just screenshotted some of the, the text and I just kept applying this in. I'm not entirely sure what it says, but it looks pretty cool. Using a bit of cardboard and some spray paint, I'm able to create some of these sharp lines and yeah, just adding in some texture as well with the spray paint, it really gives it that kind of cool graphic look that I was trying to achieve. The 
beauty about this type of artwork is it can be very loose and I don't really think there is a right or wrong way to go about this. Uh, in this case, I'm just having fun. I really am. Overall, I am so happy with how this piece is turning out. The whole process, it really, it was a bit of a nightmare when I first started as because I wasn't working off a reference I, I found it quite difficult to kind of just embrace the creative process but I stuck at it and yeah it really really came together in the end I'm so happy with it it was a great learning process and in the future, when I do something similar on canvas, I would definitely apply a layer of lacquer towards the end to really bring out all them rich colours and give it a lovely gloss finish. So we're coming to the end of the video now. I really hope you guys enjoyed the whole process and enjoyed the video. And yeah, if you're new to the channel, give us a subscribe. This really helps promote the content and it gives me that drive to keep producing more videos. But one love, big thanks, see you later.